The mouth is a very versatile part of the body. It enables you to tell jokes, perform concerts in the shower, and a crowd favorite, eat. Today we will look at how the various parts of the mouth work in concert to digest the food you eat. You walk downstairs and smell freshly baked cookies. Your mouth waters, or more accurately, your mouth salivates. When you smell food, the salivary glands release saliva, a fluid made of water mostly, as well as proteins, mucus, minerals, and enzymes. Salivation is the first step in the digestive process. It prepares the mouth to receive and break down food. Saliva, aka spit, serves many important functions, including the enzyme in it, salivary amylase, breaks down food into a liquid form that is easier for the body to digest. Saliva also serves as an indicator for how well hydrated you are. Dry mouth, drink more water. It also prevents tooth decay by removing bacteria and dead cells from the mouth. You have 32 adult teeth that rip and chew your food. There are four types of adult teeth, canines, incisors, premolars, and molars. The canines or vampire teeth are the very pointy teeth found on the top and bottom of your mouth. They help tear food apart. The incisors are the front four teeth on the top and bottom of your mouth that hold and cut your food. They also sense the texture of your food. The premolars have two cusp and also cut and tear food. They are found right behind your canines and are slightly smaller than molars. The molars are the last kind of adult teeth. They provide broad surface on which food is ground into mush. You have three types of salivary glands. The parotid glands are the largest of the three types and are found in the cheeks. The other glands are found on the floor of the mouth and are also widely dispersed under the tongue. Speaking of your tongue, your tongue is actually a very flexible muscle. The tongue contains nerves, blood vessels, and tiny receptors known as taste buds that are part of what enable you to taste your food. The tongue facilitates movement of your food in your mouth, pushing food to your teeth if it needs to be chewed and down to the throat when you are ready to swallow. Your mouth is responsible for two types of digestion, mechanical and chemical. Mechanical digestion is a process of physically breaking down your food into smaller pieces. Chewing is the first step of mechanical digestion. Chemical digestion is the process of breaking down food molecules through chemical reactions. Like mechanical digestion, chemical digestion begins in the mouth. Saliva's amylase enzyme helps chemically deconstruct carbohydrates. Though food and water and air regularly pass through your mouth and down your throat, you rarely choke. This is because there is a leaf-shaped flap of cartilage that acts as a guard to your windpipe. This flap is called the epiglottis. While breathing, the epiglottis remains open, allowing air to pass from your mouth down the windpipe to your lungs. When swallowing, however, the epiglottis closes to prevent food from entering your windpipe and choking you. Instead of passing through the windpipe, food travels from your mouth down the esophagus to your stomach. There are four major muscles responsible for chewing. One of these muscles, the masseter, has a rectangular shape, moves your jawbone, and is actually the strongest muscle in the body, capable of exerting up to 200 pounds of pressure. Once food is a chewed up round mass, it is called a bolus. Once this bolus has passed through the stomach and undergone more chemical and mechanical processing, it is now known as chyme. The roof of your mouth is actually made up of two parts, the hard palate and the soft palate. The hard palate is formed from bones that do not move. The soft palate is made up of muscle and is capable of movement. The hard palate accounts for two-thirds of your mouth's roof and is located in the front of the mouth. The soft palate is located at the back of the mouth, closer to the throat. I hope this helps you with mouth's digestion. Thanks for watching, and Moomoo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.